Here's an art project you can do with your child for St. Patrick's Day, making a shamrock. So what you'll need is some construction paper. I happen to have this color, green construction paper, but whatever color is fine. And you could even do it in white as well if you'd like. If you'd like to have them paint it green, you could do that as well. So I just cut it out of green construction paper. And then you can have them put some gold glitter on, some um, popcorn seeds because they're kind of a gold color. Or you could even do a green collage with different things. I have some beads and some pom-poms. You could have leaves and grass, whatever you can find that's green. Something that I do when I start off projects in my classroom is I have my kids write their name first on their paper and then turn it over and then start gluing on the items. And this I find is a lot easier for kids to learn how to write their names when they're writing it on their art project than saying, okay you guys, let's come sit down and I'll learn how to write our names. So I find it's really helpful to do it that way. And one way, if your child is just starting off learning how to write their name, a good way to, to help them do that is, of course, to take their hand and show them how the letters go, but to do the dots. So write their name in dots. So I'm just going to write my name, Cullen, in dots. There's the C. U. L, L, and I just say the letters as I'm doing it and also ask them, okay, what's the first letter in your name? What's the second letter? Okay, what comes after E? C-U-L-L-E-N, good job. And then what I do is have them trace it. So they're kind of doing a dot to dot and going over the letters like that. Now, it's also great to spread it out because they are fine motors. They're just learning those fine motor skills. So do it pretty big. And then as they get more control over their writing, then it'll be easier for them to make it smaller and smaller as they go. And then I always tell my kids, write your name, then turn it over. And so then they're, they're following directions too. So writing their name, turning it over, and then starting on their project. So I hope you enjoy this art idea for um, for St. Patrick's Day. Oh, and this pattern will also be on Cullen's ABCs under themes.